Alright people, welcome back to some more One Finger Death Punch. So, I am super tired, but we're gonna go ahead and play anyway. You know, I woke up early, didn't take a nap, now it's late. It's about time I go to bed, but I'm still just recording everything for today. You know, the day that you see this going up. So, I want to make sure that, you know, everything is nice and recorded, because uh, the day this is going up Thursday is actually my date with, uh, um, you know, high school girl. So I know you guys are really looking forward to hearing about that. That'll be in, uh, oh, the, the ball fucked me up. That'll be on, uh, Daily Duels on, uh, Friday, tomorrow. So if you want to go ahead and hear the juicy deeds, probably nothing's going to happen. I mean, I don't know, we'll take her on a date, and we'll talk, and watch a movie. Uh, we're watching Annie. Annie, I know. You know, you remember, you know, Annie, remember that? She was a white orphan girl, now she's a black orphan girl. Good times, good times. And yes, it's a freaking musical, too. Oh my god. I don't know, maybe it's just me right now, but the enemies are coming super fast. So, it's a musical. So, it's a super chick flick, but, hey, I mean, she wants to watch it, so, alright. You know? It's been forever since I went to movie theater. I haven't went to a movie theater since 2006, so... Almost 10 years since I went to a damn movie theater. Hello? So... Definitely gonna go ahead and, uh... Enjoy myself. Or at least try to, anyway, because... You know, it's not my cup of tea, but, you know, that's what she wants to go ahead and watch in movie theater. I mean... I mean, she's the woman, right? You know? That's what she wants to watch, so that's what we're gonna watch. As simple as that. Whew! And did it with that slow motion kick butt power thing. Uh, so, we pretty much gotta go around this entire circle. Playing stages. Eventually, we'll beat everything in this game. Everything in this game? I know they have, like, Oh, different modes in this game, I know that, you know, like, there is a straight-up survival mode. Wow, what the fuck, you saw that. Did you see that, hello? Like, I hit, and then that guy was, like, right there, and it was like, no, nah, I didn't count, like, you talking about, he was, like, right there. Like, he was, like, borderline on my freaking attack. Like, I should get freaking brownie points for attacking him on the dot like that. But nope, nope, this game's like, nope, 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 get punished. Damn it, how'd I miss the ball twice? Hello? Oh, there goes my ball because I was busy throwing daggers. Ooh, see some colored people coming after me. Is that racist? You know, we don't love them colored people. That way. Whew. I don't even know why I'm doing this, but alright. Alright, I get it. Impaled. How many times do you gotta splash impaled? On the damn screen before it's not cool anymore. Just once. <laughs> it was cool the first time. I remember when this game used to have so much luster to it. I was like, oh my god, look at all these freaking cool combos and shit that I'm doing. Now I'm just playing just to play. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> oh my god. Yep, let's go ahead and do this dump truck round real quick. Yeah. Wonder what Grandmaster mode is like. Faster, probably. That doesn't sound fun. Master mode is already plenty fast. I mean, that's what they want to do to me. I guess I'll find out, maybe. Like I said, just like I did with student mode, I'll, I'll do for master mode and grandmaster mode. I'll put up a video and I'll be like, you guys want grandmaster? And you guys will go ahead and comment and tell me. Yeah. I'm hoping the people who said they wanted Master Mode are the same people who are watching the content. You know, the series not doing too terrible. It's not the most viewed series on my channel at all, but, you know, 
it's something different, you know. I'm a, I'm an entertainer, you know. I'm not just a Yu-Gi-Oh player. I'm an I'm I'm an entertainer. You know? I bring you guys the good content. You guys watch it, and you guys get a couple couple minutes of uh, good content that you guys can go ahead and come to reliably. This is driving me fucking crazy. That means I'm moving so damn fast that I gotta press the button hella early. All right. Yeah. <laughs> All right, like I saw when I pressed the button, it's just like, no, get that initial hit. Like, just get hit. Like, all right. Yeah, I mean, at least I got a platinum medal. Can't complain about that, right? All right, we're gonna go ahead and go this way. Yep, this way. The 220 mob brown. All right, this should be fun. I said these mob browns are getting high up in numbers. You know, it's not the game's not getting any more difficult. They're just increasing the tediousness of it all. Interesting, isn't it? Yeah, at least I still got gray out, so that's nice. So I'm guessing on Grandmaster mode I get another skill, but you know, what skill would I even want to use is the question. That's a good question. Nah, that was a super good question. What skill would I even want to use? Because it's kind of hard to find a skill that has synergy with the current skills, you know? We could do Deep Impact, but Deep Impact pretty much goes off at the same time as Grey Out, and I really don't need that. I mean, I guess it would help me kill enemies on the screen initially, and then, you know, hopefully kill a little bit more deep into uh, uh, Grey Out. I guess that would be the, uh, the idea plan. But like I said, some of these skills, you're just like, why well, I doubt I would use that, so... You know, I have these triple weapons and shit. You know, I'll always be using these because I love them skills. You know. So it's gonna it's gonna be kind of hard to figure out if we do decide to go Grandmaster, what what that last skill be, especially since we don't get any new skills. You know, if we were getting some new skills and you know I had to consider it and actually think about it, then sure. But you know, since we don't unlock any new skills anymore, it's kind of like, all right, well, what should we work with here? You know, it'll probably be deep impact. To tell you the truth. Oh, I messed that up. Yeah, so, you know, deep impact, maybe kill, you know, deep impact. Yeah, I think it goes off while uh, Grey Out is going on, I think, if I, if I remember correctly. So it would literally go gray out and now go deep impact, wipe all the enemies on the on the screen, and then new enemies should start coming and I start beating it out. So it seems like maybe it'll allow me to go deeper into um <coughs> uh, excuse me. Uh deeper into gray out, but I'm not completely sure. No, I guess I'll have to find out. Because I'm thinking off the top of my mind and I can't even think of another skill I don't even want to go with just because you know, I sat there and I looked at them, and I'm just, uh, most, I bet, the reason why I probably can't even remember them is just because they're just so, you know, anticlimactic or worth so many. Because I know there's a lot of them where it's just like, heal one health for every hundred kills. Like, wow, alright, you know? Then if it was like, heal for every, like, you know, 50 kills, maybe we could talk. But a hundred? Like, nah. Nah, you know? So... You know, some of them are either just, you know, totally not worth it. Or, uh, you know, the cost is too long, you know? You know, you got skills like Deep Impact, which wipe all the enemies on the screen for, like, 30-something. But then you got, like, Heal 1 for, like, 100. Like, hello? Like, am I missing something here? I don't know. I don't know. I didn't program the game. I just play it. Just playing it. Simple as that. Alright, that, that should've win. Don't give me that. That should've win. You know that should've win. Well, 
Where'd that ball go? The ball just straight up just left. Like, hello? I was, I was ready to use that ball. That was an interesting guy to fight. And last guy. There we go. I don't understand how I get a perfect, yet I get a miss. I don't understand that. Uh, I guess we should go around this way, because it's all going to connect in the end anyway. Now, yeah, this will probably be the last stage. Go ahead and kill these 220 of them. Call it an episode. There we go. Now they're like downgrading the enemies to only two hits, like hello. Like, what happened to the frickin' multi-hitters all of a sudden? Now they're just back down to two, like... No, not that I'm complaining. It makes it, you know, a little bit easier on me. But like I said, the game's not hard. It's just tedious. You know, and generally, I... You know, I'm not... Generally, I'm not sitting here stumped like, Oh my god, I can't beat this, you know? If I work at it, I'll eventually get it, you know? You know? And even if they're... Even their hardest stages are simple, just muscle memory. So... You know, that, that's not even that difficult. You know? What is difficult is them slowly wearing me down with the tediousness. Yeah. After a while, everybody makes mistakes, especially doing the same thing. You know? Eventually, you're going to slip up, and you know, the slip ups add up. And next thing you know, you know, you're fighting a thousand enemies, and you slip up a couple of times, you get to like the last, you know, 20 and all of a sudden you lose because you're out of health and you gotta do the whole thing over again, you know? You know, I, I pressed the button, but alright. You know? In this game, I don't fear difficulty, I fear tediousness. You know? I fear tediousness in general, actually. You know? That's why I think that's one of the reasons why I want to be a teacher, so I can avoid the tediousness, you know? As a teacher, you know, I'm gonna be teaching some new shit every day. So every day, you know, should be kind of a new experience. Did I pick up a broom? Hello? Have I ever picked up a broom before? You know, I'll just sweep you off your feet. Hello? Just massacre you with the spinning weapon and the freaking broom. So I think that's probably really because I hate tediousness. I've had I've had tedious jobs in the past and I've hated them. You know, I want to come in. I I don't want a job. I want a career. And you know, jobs jobs are the tediousness. You know, careers that's where you know that, that's where you're doing what you want to do. So, you know, that's why I want to be a teacher. That's one of the reasons why I want to be a teacher. I can tell you. I can definitely tell you it's not the pay. I can tell you that. Definitely tell you it's not the pay. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> All right. So that's done. Oh, that's another freaking uh, survival round. What's up with these survival rounds? I swear, like survival round, survival round, survival round. Like, why do you put that in here? Like, all right. So coming back, we're gonna go down this direction, down that direction, and just complete more stages. All right. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of One Finger Death Punch. So thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys uh, tomorrow with, uh, of course, Pokemon, and I'll see you guys next time with One Finger Death Punch. Alright guys, thanks for watching.